If you're wondering how long it took to crop page images into single letters for the paleography chart, you might be interested in learning more about the IIIF image API. The original image is left intact on the repository, while a URL specifies the region desired, in this case a single letter. Although Mirador is the most powerful viewer, especially for annotations, some valuable tools can only be accessed through the IIIF Navigator. A link to the IIIF Navigator is prominent on the project homepage. To use the Navigator, we need to identify a manifest, in this case, Latin Moses. We can show all resources in the manifest by clicking the appropriate radio button, then list resources in manifest. This can be thought of as a more direct visualization of the information available in Mirador. Mirador does not show the URL source of a IIIF image or provide tools to manipulate it for use elsewhere on the web. If we wanted a single letter for our paleography chart, we would click Crop and then manipulate the image and selection until the region we want is highlighted. The link in the upper right shows the IIIF image API address for just that region. Now we can send or use the web address for that region of the image without copying, editing, or attaching images. If we want a web address, not just for a region of an image, but a complete view in Mirador, we can copy and paste from the address bar. Notice when we navigate Mirador that the address in the address bar changes when we change manuscripts and pages, which are called manifests and canvases in the IIIF presentation API. We can bookmark or copy and paste these web addresses to share a particular page. The ability to specify a particular layer or region may be added in the future.